So I'm super excited to open this box that just came in the mail a couple days ago. Um, I deliberated a really long time about what kind of tools to get and if I should even get power tools because uh, in my service van I've been using Makita from our company and the company I work for we use Makita in one van, DeWalt in one van, and Milwaukee in two vans so it's kind of mixed up what we use but I've actually enjoyed using all three different brands of tools. And I was trying to decide if I should go with like Craftsman or something a little bit more affordable than the top end stuff but these tools are what I eventually decided to go with. Um, they were typically like $1,200 I think for this set and I got them on sale for $600 so I'm going to show you what they are. And I'm super excited because I've never had any power tools. Well, except for a corded black and decker drill that's like terrible. Ugh. Okay. Why do they put a box in a box? Can't they just like can't they just like stick a shipping label to this? Or like why did they do that? Oh, so it looks like it has the list of everything that I have in the box. So I'll just show the show really quick. So I got the half inch drill driver, the half inch high torque impact wrench, which that'll be really nice, and then a quarter inch hex impact driver, the multi tool, which I'm actually really excited about that too. Flashlights are very handy. The Hacksaw Reciprocating Sawzall. Circular saw. Three batteries. Charger. And two different contractor bags. And grinder. I was originally extremely skeptical of grinders for power tools, like battery operated. But I found that they're extremely useful in certain situations where you don't want to just have cords dragging and dangling everywhere. Okay, so carry on. Looks like it's upside down. Mm -hmm. I flipped it over. So we're gonna flip it over again. Oh. And it looks like it's upside down again. Mm -hmm. We gotta flip it over. No. This box, which I think is empty. I think that this is just a space filler, but let's make sure. We kind of make things like completely empty. So, what do you think is going to be in this one? What tools? Mm. I don't remember what they all were. I bet the circular saw and the hacksaw are in here. Or not the hacksaw, the circular saw and the multi-tool, as they called it. Oh no, nope, I was completely wrong. Oh, it's all the, this one has the drill and the impact. The drill. Oh, it's so exciting. Oh, that feels quality. It smells good, it looks good, I can feel it. that. Nice. These two items right here are like so important to have when you're just building stuff, doing stuff, working. And it's just so nice that they're not gonna like bog down. I can like drill holes with them and stuff very effectively. An M12 charger? Oh, oh, it's both. Look, it's an M12 and an M18 charger. Cool. So now we can get M12 tools, which is really cool. So it has both. I have not seen that before, but that's a really good idea. Batteries. I think that they come charged. Nope. Mostly dead. First gear. Looks 
Good, so two more batteries in there. That's it for that. So I guess that means everything else is in here. <laughs> All these bags are really high quality too. So we have some... Oh, so this is their M12 and M18, just like some advertisements or something. And then, must be for the charger, multi-tool, hacksaw, drills, uh, whatever that thing's called. Weird, this, why is this one slightly yellowed? I don't know. So those are all the owner's manuals. Ooh. Framing blade. So there must be nothing on this. Yep, currently there's nothing on this. Oh, that feels nice. So beautiful. You know, to be honest, I think I actually like the other, like the full length version as far as sawzalls are concerned but I think that this will be really nice it's also interesting that this front piece doesn't pivot it's all one solid piece but oh, it feels so nice it's interesting how like ergonomic wise like the drill like this looks like a retarded drill doesn't it? <laughs> yeah like, like the grip is exactly the same but it's got this weird thing on it. This must be part of the that thing. I think it's yeah. It goes with the saw they sent a strap for the bag. A saws all blade. Yep. Mm -hmm. A strap for the bag. Vacuum cleaner attachment. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that is. Here's the multi tool. So what do oh, you no, no, no. This is actually the angle grinder. This feels really nice too. There's a slight wobble in this. See that? Mm hmm. I don't like the style of lock, but I'm used to it, I guess. And it has this style removal tool for taking your cutter, cutter wheels off. This must be the multi tool. A lot of packaging. This thing I'm actually really excited about. What can you do with that? You can put all these funky blades on it and like cut, like you, I could cut a perfectly square hole in this really easily. <laughs> you can't picture what I'm talking about. I don't know why you would ever want to do that. Oh, I wouldn't want to. <laughs> you want me to test it on the camera? <laughs> They, they just like oscillate really fast so you get like a two inch blade on here and it's just like so you can <clears throat> make really precise small cuts and stuff this is the flashlight oh that feels nice too it has a hangy thingy made of some really tough plastic I'm surprised they didn't go with some kind of metal for that but it feels really tough Yep, and that's that's a flashlight. Feel that. Guard for the angle grinder. Oh, sweet. The oscillating tool also has a sander, right which oh, we nice. need for in the kitchen right now. Perfect. Yeah, so that's gonna be fantastic. And oh, here's one of the cutting things. Mhm, mm for the multi tool. Yep. 
And this is going to be nice because we have to change the tire on one of our vehicles. We don't really have an air one that works because <clears throat> we don't have an air compressor that has enough juice. Yet. <laughs> Yet. So that's going to be nice. Ooh. This feels really powerful. <laughs> cool. And that's everything from inside that bag. Yay. Uh, the the Rubbermaid Tupperwares did not come with, even though they have the same color scheme. <laughs> so that is all of the tools, nicely laid out on the floor. Thanks for helping me video. And we will be using these in a lot of the upcoming videos, I'm sure because now I have them and I'm going to use them whenever I have an opportunity to. So anyway, hope that you enjoyed this very short unboxing video. And that's all, because the battery's dying. <laughs>